This right here is a video that I've been wanting to film for a very long time. If I was a little more organized, I would have come here to the outskirts of Bolivia during their rainy season because today our mission is very simple. We're trying to get the ultimate reflection. One where the water causes the sky to cause this out of body experience and you see double. Basically the sky becomes the ground. Again, it's dry season so we got to keep our fingers crossed we can find enough water to make that happen. And the second mission of the day, if we so choose to accept it, is to flex our photography muscles because, well, I mean, look at this. So, to start our trip, we're gonna start it where you'll start yours, in the city of La Paz. All right. Bye bye. Here we go. Our one-way flight to Uyuni. Uyuni! We've dropped our stuff, but we're now headed to the salt flats. We'll come check out the hotel room later tonight when it's time for check-in. You're looking very cool. Really? I'm ready. So this is crazy. We're just driving through the salt flat, well, before the salt flat, and they're like, oh yeah, ostriches up ahead. There's wild ostriches out here. I was not expecting that. So one of the really cool things about this is we've got about 12,000 square kilometers of salt flat. It's the largest in the entire world. And one of the cool things is that actually below the salt flats, you actually have some water in certain areas. And so what you're seeing here is some crazy geothermic activities. activities. The earth is letting out its air. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And? Is it cold? Ah! No, okay, nothing happened. No, 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 Kristen. <laughs> So we're about maybe an hour and a half, two hours into the salt flat and so far we have not had any signs of water, anything that will really give us that reflection that I'm just like fingers crossed hoping we get. Uh, it's 3 o'clock and sunsets at 5.30 so that doesn't give us a ton of time but one thing is for sure, we're going to make a quick stop here, have some lunch and then we're going to challenge those photography muscles. Mi princesa, oh que hermosa, que guapa. Have some headache, but a little altitude I had a sickness. Little nap and I'm well, better. you're in luck because uh, by some crazy chance we just found this lunch waiting for us over here. That's so epic. One of the really cool activities the tour company has set up for us. I'm not gonna lie, the wind is kind of uh, killing the vibe a little bit, <laughs> but we're gonna roll with it. Let's see what we got. So we got some chicken, some beef in drawer number two. What's in the box? We got some rice and some quinoa. Hola. Est-ce que tu peux montrer les les manger? Les manger. That's not correct. <laughs> Don't forget to eat your greens. Gracias. I should mention they actually filmed the last Jedi here. Which is kind of cool. Surviving and Salud. thriving. Salud. 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 Ah! <laughs> okay, so there's a reason we brought that mask and many, many more ridiculous things, and this might be the most exciting part of the video for me at least. So let's cut to it. What do we have here? Hollywood on a budget, baby. Let's do this. Okay, so the second mission of the day to get ridiculous videos was a complete success. Huge <laughs> thank you to the Bolivian traveler. <laughs> but we still haven't seen the reflection and the sun sets in an hour. No, I take that back, 35 minutes. We're going really fast right now, 110 kilometers, and it feels like on a highway. It's really cool. Mm -hmm. It's really you can't trippy. tell how fast are you going because there's nothing around. No, there's nothing. I took a photo from the airplane this morning, and we're trying to find it in a map. And we're just driving there. Scale on an airplane, a bit tricky. <laughs> it looks like water there. Yeah, it? yeah, but that's the shadow. That's the shadow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was uh, thinking the same thing. We're sending up a scout. Find the water. What's his name? Inca. 
We yeah. found water, or Inca found water. Inca found water. <laughs> and it's so far, right? I'm just flying to see how far away it is. Things are not looking good here, guys. The sun is almost set, and we know where the water is, but it's still pretty much another three or four kilometers away. We might have to do a sunrise mission here. Guys, we're almost there. Look at this. Wow. Destructive to a car, but constructive to my heart. Right, that doesn't make sense. Look at that, it's crazy. And this is not even a fraction of what it's like during the wet season, guys, but just, uh, this is why I came to the salt flats. This is insane. It was incredible. So and beautiful. Right now you see just a little bit of water, but just imagine everything, absolutely everything covered, making a huge humongous mirror. That's it's what really wet magical. season is. Yeah. January to March, we will be coming back. I played a clip at the beginning of the video and it was actually Andre's footage. The legend holding the spotlight. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> One last way to finish off the evening. Some uh, frostbite Salud. and some wine. Perfecto. Es perfecto. Mm -hmm. y Salud. Buenas noches. The car doesn't want to turn on. Cero contacto? We are sí, trapped! <laughs> Drama's always good for the vlog, though. Empujemos un cachito. You're not gonna push, I'm gonna push. Vamos! Vamos, push it back to home. Let's go! Uno, dos, tres, home! More, 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 more! I don't want to be stuck here. It's a nice place to be stuck, look at that. It's beautiful. I was so excited about this area, now I want to get out of here. <laughs> hey, one more time. We made it back to the Salt Palace. This is the hotel for tonight. It's so nice and warm in here. Everything is made of salt, including the ground, the couch. And it's nice and warm in here too. The fire's roaring. I love the vibe. But let's see the room. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. So pretty. The couch, the bed frame is actually all made out of salt. I love it. This couldn't be more perfect for where we are. It's very cute. It is right now 5 a.m. Super early morning wake up call, like 4.30 alarm and very little sleep. But we are not giving up on that reflection. We've come this far, it's dry season, but we won't let mother nature tell us what we can expect. Oh my gosh, it's frio. Guys, I don't know how this turned out so beautifully, but literally we were about prepared to go an hour and a half back to where we were yesterday. Instead, today's driver knew the area a bit better, and he was like, oh, there's a spot with some water. Well, like 10 minutes away. And it's full of water, look. He also has boots. <laughs> Such a lifesaver. So right now, we are in perfect position for what is going to be a magical, magical reflection. I don't see any clouds in the sky, which I would have hoped for some because they really help with the reflection, but whew, we just got the most amazing photo. Yeah. All thanks. To Andres, he's the best. <laughs> you have to spotlight magic. yourself now. Okay, so we're gonna try to shoot a couple more things here. We got the tripod set up. We're doing long exposure photos and it's cold. It's very, very cold out. We're standing in freezing water. But uh, that's what you gotta do to get the bread. That is the sunrise coming up over the mountain there. And it's creating a double like effect. So you got that reflection going on. It's so unbelievably beautiful. Was it worth the sunrise? Yes, for sure. This is one of my favorite I almost sunrises. lost my feet, but it was yeah. totally worth it. I know, my feet, <laughs> my feet are so cold. <laughs> but no joke, this is uh, one of the top sunrises I've ever had. Just. Yeah. So Based on where we are, you, you can't beat it. It's so incredible. Wow.
This morning was freaking incredible and I owe so many thank yous to Henry. Henry is the reason we found that place. Like we got the local expertise and otherwise we could have gone like two hours out of the way and still not had even close to that. So legend, MVP, he gave me one of the most beautiful moments of my entire life. It's something I'll keep with me forever. I'll never forget that morning. And if you tuned into this video to check out the reflection, don't leave yet because I'll tell you why. We're going to see some just as incredible places here today as we leave Uyuni to go, where are we going? 100 kilometers from here or so, there's lagoons, colored lagoons, flamingos, Mountains, volcanoes, that's, and we're going that's to the uh, National Reserve. So, stay tuned. Yes, sir. And we're back. Warmth. We're alive. Look at this right here. That is the feeling of life. Warmth. But showing our clothes. Look. It's salt, okay. salt, salt. Andres literally had these like up to his ankle in salt. Kathy calls him a masochist because one of his crazy hobbies is to occasionally do night lapses where you basically stay out during the night, like the coldest part of the day, and you just wait for your camera to get some amazing star lapses. It takes some sacrifice to get good, good footage, especially when it comes to night shooting. We are all packed up and it's time to continue on with the road trip. So we have a new driver, a new car. Hola, Noel. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Look at Bill, you bees. Let's see where we wake up. Ew, it tastes horrible. <laughs> Altitude can't stop us now. All right. This is what the road is looking like. Six hours of <laughs> dirt, gravel, <laughs> loose terrain, and rivers. But we're gonna make it. And oh yeah, we've crossed like hundreds of alpacas, which has been quite a treat. Can I pee? <laughs> Can, Can we stop? Do you want me to vlog or? If you want to. <laughs> okay, bye. Hopefully there's no backup camera on this car. <laughs> All right, we have arrived. And the mademoiselle, where are we? Valle de la Roca. Is that actually what it's called? Yeah. Check it out, guys. It's like some Stonehenge kind of stuff here. We got some incredible volcanic rocks all around us. We're all surrounded by volcanoes. Yeah? Like, everywhere, yeah? Well, that's fine. Some would say Latinas are a bit of a volcano themselves. You never quite know when they're gonna erupt. Unpredictable, dangerous, highly flammable. Calientes. <laughs> So, currently here, sneaking up on a pack of alpacas, here in the wild. Oh crikey. Now here's the thing guys, you gotta keep it down, real quiet. It's a very dangerous species. One wrong move, and they will devour you. Quiet feet, silent feet, here we go. All right guys, quick update. So far they've accepted me as their own. We gotta keep it low key here though. One move and they'll realize that I'm not an alpaca. Go oh, crazy. Half of the fun of having a drone and a landscape like this is pushing it to its limits. So we're gonna go full FPV mode, see what we can do with a Mavic 2. We have made it to Biamar after about six hours on the road with a lot of stops. This has been one of the most beautiful, like visually beautiful moments and days of my life. Like the sunset tonight was incredible. The sunrise this morning at the salt flats. How could you top that? It's just unbelievable. Bolivia has really, really, really blown me away. All right, three, two, one, hit it. That was the best check-in I've ever had. Time to go check out the room. Welcome to our beautiful room in yeah, traditional Villamar. style. Kind of cool. It's really cute. We got heated blankets, which is kind of nice. Yeah. <laughs> next week on Saturday, we're following up the Bolivia series with our next video. So make sure to subscribe. And if you enjoyed today's video, smash that like button. It's free. But wait. There's more. <clears throat> I have a cold right now, so I figured I'd make the most of it.
Coming very soon to Los LeBlanc is the Lost Creator Academy, where I teach you everything I know. There's a link down below that you can check out if you want to get notified when the Academy is launched. And yeah, it's free to sign up. It's not going to be free. But you do get a discount if you use that link down there, so uh, check that out. Please leave the video a big thumbs up, and let's get lost again in the next one.